My name is Tristan and I'm in my second year at high school. And I've chosen this painting called The Sick Man by L. A. Ring. The colors in this painting are mainly very dark and very subdued, very gray, very gloomy. It's very black here in the foreground and then it's very gray in the background. At the same time, there are so many colors contrasting with this black. It's very white here and even more importantly, there's a sort of contrast with all that black, all that dark. And there's also a lot of light in the painting because of this open window. And there's also a lot of light in the face of this old woman. The colors are like that because that was enough for this poor smallholder's cottage. So that's what they could afford. It would be very unrealistic if they had sumptuous colors. I chose this painting because I think it deals with some really universal themes that weren't only relevant in 1902. Naturally, they were poor smallholders, and we don't have those anymore in Denmark today. Farming functions in a different way today, and that's also what it works with, that they're old, that this thing is dying out, this farming culture they had before. These old people are the last of that generation, so the painting works with these closing chapters. These closing chapters of the story, but also more universal closing chapters. That is, closing chapters of life because of these old people, and one of them is even sick. Because of that, I think the painting also works with a kind of renewal. It isn't just gloomy, it isn't just that this world is falling apart. There's also something new, and you don't know what this new thing is, but there is something. When you look at this painting, I don't feel as much sadness as you might think. I feel as if there is a very peaceful state of mind in this painting. What you notice most is the old lady who looks very peaceful. And the mood she has, I think it sort of rubs off on the people who see it. And also there is somehow a kind of feeling of hope in this painting.